and I'm the stylist for St. Patel Center Spark. And today I'm going to show you a few ways to tuck in your classic white button down. Just leaving it loose is great, but if you want a little bit more of a polished look, classic French tuck is a great place to start. All you do to style that is grab the hemline of your shirt and tuck it into the waist of your pants. You then blouse out the front and leave the back untucked. This is a really great look if you just wanna be easy, relaxed, casual, but still have your outfit feel very pulled together. Next look I'm gonna show you, my personal favorite, is the one-sided tuck. So you wanna start with your shirt out, you unbutton right up to where the waistline of your pants is. And you always want to tuck in the side that is closest to your body. So usually that's the size, side with the buttons. So you tuck that in, blouse out the side closest to your body, and leave this tail out. It's great, it defines your waist, adds a little bit more visual interest than the classic French tuck. Another tuck that I'm going to show you is a classic. It's the full tuck. This is great if you want to look really polished. Works with jeans, but also a pencil skirt is a great work look. So again, you start from the front, tucking in as tight as you can, and work your way around each side, all the way to the back. What I like to do to keep this tuck feeling a little bit more modern is create a more of a high-low situation and tuck the front in a little tighter than the back. The last thing I'm gonna show you isn't a tuck. It's a nice casual way to wear a white shirt. If it's feeling a little bit more fun, going to the beach, wearing it with shorts. Again, you unbutton right to the waistline of your pants. The back of the shirt, roll it up slightly. Create two tails. and tie together at your waist.